So today is a super special day for me because it is my last day of nursing school ever. This is just so unbelievably crazy. This is the last time I'm ever gonna wear my student scrubs. <sighs> it is such a good feeling. I can't believe I actually made it. My pinning ceremony was a couple days ago and I literally bawled my eyes out when I came back from it. The only thing that I have left is in an hour, I have a simulation. My patient is going to have a heart attack and I'm gonna have to do my stuff and pass that and then I will be a graduated college woman. And I'm so excited. I'm nervous for the simulation, but I'm just like so excited at the same time just to get this like over with and just be like, I graduated. So, and today is super nice out too, which totally just makes the day even better. And I get to see my boyfriend right after and I haven't seen him in like a week. So we're gonna go out to eat and he's also graduating as well. So we're going out to celebrate. So today is just gonna be a really good day. Hey everyone, welcome back. Chase and I just graduated, we're done. How does it feel, Chase? Good. We are officially done. Okay, we have, okay, we both have like one more assignment that we both have to turn in, but then we're done. And we're gonna go out yeah. and celebrate, and we've been listening to Long Live by Taylor Swift on repeat for the past 20 minutes. Or at least I did when I was driving over to his house. And now we're gonna go eat pulled pork at one of her favorite restaurants. But I'm so proud of us because we did it and I can't believe that we're college graduates from the University of Michigan. We did it. So I'm beginning to pack my room right now and I just feel very overwhelmed because I have so much stuff to pack. I just don't even know where to start, but I'm gonna try to donate a lot of stuff and my studio in Grand Rapids is super, super small. So I'm not gonna be able to fit as much stuff as I have here right now. So I have to get rid of a lot of stuff or just leave things here at the house. And I don't even know where to start. There's so much to go through, so yeah. I have so much to update you guys on. I am so sorry I have been not I haven't been posting like a whole lot lately and I've just been really busy. Well first I took a trip to Charleston in Savannah and we stopped in Tennessee and did a whole bunch of other stuff with my boyfriend Chase. So that was a super cool trip. Also I've been studying for the NCLEX which is coming up and I'm actually keeping my NCLEX date a secret. I'm super nervous about it. My mom and dad don't even know. The only person that knows the date of the test is my boyfriend Chase. And he's also taking his final police test to get into the police academy the same day. I'm taking the NCLEX. So it's gonna be a huge day for the both of us. And we are both so nervous because if I don't pass, I have the potential for losing my job and not being able to move to Grand Rapids. And I have to wait like another 40 days or something like that to pass the test again. And then my boyfriend Chase, if he doesn't pass his test, he can't take the test again for six months. And like guys, I hope he doesn't mind me saying this, but we are so ready to get married. And I think the only thing that's like really stopping us is we just really wanna make sure that we're both like financially stable enough to be able to get married. So please keep us in your prayers for these upcoming tests because these tests are just, we've been working really hard for them and we just really need to pass to be able to achieve our goals. Um, What else do I have to tell you guys? So yes, I did graduate and graduating from nursing school was like literally the best feeling ever. And I don't think it really hit me that I graduated until after my pinning ceremony. I literally got in the car and I just burst out crying. And I was actually thinking about not even going to my pinning ceremony because we weren't able to pick who pinned us. We only had like one teacher pinning us and it was like a teacher I never had before. And I was just like, should I even go? And I'm super glad I did because that was the first time that I got to see all my classmates since the beginning of COVID. 
I was not emotional, but it, again, it was like right when I got back in my car was an, when it really hit me that I did it. I feel like I'm going to get emotional now again, but I just remember like so many days being in the car and driving like home from school and just being so worried like can I do this can I pass and just having like hard days at clinical and being like is this ever gonna be done like after my pinning ceremony I was like wow I did it like I did it I graduated I feel like when I'm in Grand Rapids, I'm going to have like a lot more free time to be able to like post more videos and like have a place of my own and like decorate it and show you guys around and I'm just really excited to like grow this channel a little bit more. So I love you guys. Thank you so much for watching my channel and thank you for being with me through all of my life changes. This is a very exciting time. Oh, there it is. Tell everyone how much we love each other. We love each other. I'm afraid you're going to drop this. <laughs> I'm afraid too. I'll hold it. Okay. <laughs> Pants in the way. <laughs> there you go. <coughs> Ooh. Break that. Oh. Someone wants to say hi. It's Autumn. Say hello, baby. So I have my camera like right near the window. So that's probably why it's loud and you might hear like neighbors and stuff. But my little sister and I went shopping today and I just wanted to show you a few things. So the first thing that I got was this really cute necklace and I thought this would be so cute with like a t-shirt that I'm wearing now or just to like dress up. Um, I really want to go out to my favorite restaurant in Michigan. It's called Pinkies and it's such a cute restaurant and I have a cute dress that I also think this necklace will look really cute with. So I'm like, I love this. I'm glad I bought it. The next thing I've been wanting for so long and I'm so happy that I finally got a pair um, I went to Aerie and I got these really cute bike shorts. Um, and one thing that I love about these shorts is they have little pockets here so I can put my phone in there. I'm taking yet another trip. Um, I'm going to see my friend Kayla that lives out in Boston and we're going hiking a lot. So I bought some um, of these bike shorts because I thought it'd be perfect. And I honestly, okay, I tried them on and I freaking love them because they're so soft and they're the perfect length. They're not too long and they're not too short. And I seriously might regret not buying like more of these because they're so comfortable. Um, the next thing that I got was from Aeropostale and I feel like no one shops there anymore. But like every once in a while, I'll see something like really cute and they honestly had really good deals going on with their swimsuits. Like their swimsuits were so cheap. And I got this like the top and the bottom together for I think like 27 or something like that, which I think is really cheap. Cause sometimes like I'll look at a bikini top and it'll be like 30 or $50 just for the top. So I had, these are the bottoms. I thought that was really cute. And then here's the top. And I thought that was so adorable. And look, it could probably go with my little necklace I got, but I thought that was super cute. And I love how it probably, hopefully will bring out my eyes. I'm gonna put my hair in, hold on guys. I'm gonna put my hair in this little clip. I have been loving these little butterfly clips. Perf, okay. As you guys know, I'm moving to Grand Rapids in early June, so just a few more weeks. And um, I went and bought some towels, just like some hand towels. And these are super cheap too. These, I think I only paid like nine or $10 for the both of these. These are just hand towels for the bathroom. Um, But you guys can kind of see like over there, I got a ton of stuff like just packed up and I've been taking more things off the walls and getting rid of like a lot of things, donating a lot of things. 
And honestly, like my bedroom, I think is going to be really empty pretty soon because I'm getting rid of my dresser, which is over here, my desk, which is over here, my little nightstand, my lamp. Like I'm getting rid of all those big furniture pieces and my bed is coming with me. Um, let me show you guys one last thing that I got. This is my little plant and I feel like I might have shown you guys in like another video, but I cannot remember. And my plant has been growing so much and I literally have done nothing and I don't know the name of the plant. I have seriously just like kept it in water and that's it. But I thought this would be so cute in my new apartment. And honestly guys, I probably shouldn't have gotten anything like decorative like this until I'm actually in my apartment and I know I have room for it because my apartment is a studio so it's going to be super tiny but like the roots have grown so much it's just crazy so it's been fun watching it grow but I really like this I think it's so look at the little bottom I think it, that's so cool here's a lot of the stuff that I've just been packing I don't have a whole lot yet um packed up actually there's like nothing in these bins but that's where i'm gonna put a lot of my clothes and like i just had picture frames and then one thing i'm so excited for is just having these in my apartment the been there series mugs that i've been collecting but i'm super bummed because i went to a starbucks in savannah and they didn't have one for savannah georgia like starbucks doesn't even make them so i was like oh man and yes, I think I am going to bring my Harry Potter wand from Universal because I think it'd be kind of cool to like have it out under my TV set or something like that. I don't know. I think that is it. I think that's all I have to share with you guys. And I love you. Thank you so much for watching my videos. Subscribe to my channel. Let me know things that you want to see. And I love you guys so much. You're amazing.